We're broadcasting straight to your screen from Arrow in Your Head Stadium in the appropriately named Carcass City, Misery. It's always festive during NFL season. They bring in all the carcasses and dress them up in Crokeland jerseys. But the smell, oh, oh Lord have mercy. Oh, the smell. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Philadelphia Eagles go up against the Carcass City Creeps. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi again, everyone. Grim Blitzrow here, along with the only guy to ever get cut from the league for testing positive for not taking enough steroids or mutant growth hormones. Brickhead Mulligan. Hey, there was a reason for that. I had to quit taking steroids. My nutsack was shrinking, and I sprouted this mini me on my shoulder. Bricks Jr., freak me out. You're a pussy. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. Whoa. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with us. And the defense gets the quarterback for a sack. Third down and three. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street ball. First down. And it's first and ten. And that's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth? What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something Unique About Yourself. That's unique. The Roid Rage Dirty Trick transforms a player into a rampaging lunatic for the drink. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. And here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Catch that. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Hot. They pick up nine with that catch. Uh, not enough for first, but still a nice game. 
And that'll bring up second and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Eight. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two. Eight. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. And that'll bring up third down and in inches. Oh, my gosh. The defensive player looks like he's lost his boom. Dead and down. Sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. Touchdown. Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkeys getting ran through his back side from that bad burn he had last year. because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. And this is going to be a rocket shot to the moon. That looked like the QB's fault. If he held the ball spikes out like he was supposed to, the kicker would have never missed. And it's first and ten. He picks up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. <laughs> this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and ten. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second down and ten. <laughs> oh, nice hit! And it's first and ten. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. And that 
that's an incomplete pass. Looks like the defense got away with that one there. Uh, I love it when the receiver like that. He could get hurt. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Man, what a hit that was. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Most kickers should be able to make this one. But will this kicker make it? Find out next time on NFL Game Day. Uh, NFL, and it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. First and ten. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Third down and five. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Shit. Ooh, and that's what they call the money shot. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. And that's some good old-fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. And that'll bring up second and one. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he laterals at the last second. Nifty move there. First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, telling me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. And then Catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Right. 
And it's first and ten. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. This is your brain, and this is your brain on... Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. He's at the ten. Touchdown! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. He picks up five on that play. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Oh, I love the murder ball, Daddy. He caught it. And nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh, his head just exploded. down and long and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref they say we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore first down and forever hot, hot one hot two hot Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Hot one, hot. Good thing they know. Good catch in the end. Boom! <laughs> Third down and forever. Nice pass for a 10-yard gain. Uh, it's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down in our hearts. Two minutes remain in the half. Great. I'm going to take a dump. Any field goals over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. Hey. He is automatic. Nice kick. All right. Just get the points. So let's move on. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And it's first and ten. lateral to his teammate. We're talking street ball here, Brick. And a hard run there picks up the first down. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just gonna take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. And 
And this guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Hey, he makes up a name for himself. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> the quarterback just used his final timeout. Let's see what they come up with on the next play. Third down and three. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Oh, and the ball falls to the ground. That's incomplete. He needs to throw it when a receiver can catch it. What's he doing? And uh, groundbreaking analysis as always there, Bricks. Oh, thank you. I do my part. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. He's got the distance, and the kick is good! They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Oh, he just got crushed! In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. The defense has the receivers covered well. That's a three-yard gain on that pass. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show, sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to start as the teams take the field. This game has been one lopsided route. Yeah, football games are kind of like boobs. Big or small, they're both great. Except for when they're lopsided. Uh, okay. Back the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Second down and two. The defensive end is going to work. The dirty trick. This play is usually good for a quick start. That was a nice piece of running, Ben. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. for the extra point. It's good. 
The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Oh no, it's a sticky ball dirty trick. The defense pretty much turned the ball into a yo-yo and picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Roid Rage, how do you like your brains? Scrambled or fried? And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. Straight through the uprights. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. And it's first and ten. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Second down in a lot. Oh, if I was that QB, I'd be pissed. You want to do some fun on your turn. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. That play didn't work. They'll have to rethink that. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Hot, hot. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and ten. 
Stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. He boomed that one. Let's see if they... Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. And it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. Second and eight to go. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Graham. You're right. And it's first and ten. Ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. He had it for a second there. Third and two. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And they run it for a couple of yards. <laughs> and that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. That run is good for nine yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two, hot three. He refuses to go down. Oh, and the quarterback threads the needle for a first down. <laughs> first down and three. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown.
Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Britch's ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah, she called it rabbit sense. I th Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And that'll bring up second and one. Talk for the first down. That's some seven yards. Oh, no. I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick it in a plastic bag. Say the alphabet. Man, oh, man. He hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out... That's a six-yard gain. <laughs> and that'll be second down and four. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Second down and a very lot. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim. But my watch is a bit slow. <laughs> I don't understand. Why are they going for it, Grim? This seems like the situation where they should always... Oh. No doubt about it. That guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, three. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Second down and six. throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. This really puts the fun back in... Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. <laughs> and it's first and ten. his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. It's the fourth quarter, and we're at the two-minute warning. Two minutes to what? Second down and two. Was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants. The defense calls timeout. They must be trying to get on their QB's good side. Third down and a pussy here. Yeah, that line the way. 
way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And with one timeout remaining, the defense has to get something going here. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards. No more timeout for the defense. Or the offense, Bricks. That's that's the important part. Second down and six. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And it's first and ten. You've got to catch that. Second down and ten. game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Third and two. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. Well, the creeps lose at home. They just rolled over and played dead most of the game. A lot of them are dead, Gwen. And the ones that ain't, the fans will kill them. They've got 99 problems, but a win ain't one of them. That's right, Gwen. Just like a bridge over troubled water. Like a whole lot of Rosie. The game's most valuable player is speaking about the victory now. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so...